Hey guys, so this video is going to be on a just to get ready with me. Um, I was gonna get ready, so I decided to just film it. So, first, I'm gonna start off with priming my face with the Too Faced Hangover. I like this one a lot because it's very moist moisturizing and um yeah I am more dry skin so I like to go more towards moisturizing and illuminating primers so I'm just applying it all over my face and as you can see I am kind of kind of no I am breaking out around my cheek area and my forehead I forgot to wash my face for like two nights and all of a sudden I started breaking out so that's why I look like this. So now I'm going to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water and I'm just going to put this all over my face. So I'm going to use the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte and I'm in the shade 103. So I'm just going to put this all over my face and I'm going to go in with the damp beauty blender. So I'm just going to apply a little bit more to the areas where I have acne. So right here, a little bit more on my forehead, and around the nose. So I'm just going back in and going over where I put the rest of the foundation. All right, so now I'm gonna go in with concealer and I'm going to be using the Instant Age Rewind by Maybelline and the Maybelline Fit Me. In the Age Rewind, I am light pale and in the Fit Me, I am number 20, which is sand beige. So I go in with the Fit Me first and I just put it, I'm just going to put that all under my eye and a little bit more on where I have acne. Next I'm going to go in with Age Rewind and just going to highlight, I'm going to highlight the under eye. As you can see this one's a lighter than the Fit Me. So I use this one for brightening. So I'm going to go back in with the Beauty Blender and blend it out. Sorry, not the Beauty Blender. I'm going to go in back with the Real Techniques and blend everything out. Right now I'm going to set my under eyes with the Kat Von D Shade and Light palette and I'm going to use the yellow one, which is Lyric. And I'm just going to pat that on my under eye. So next I'm going to do my eyebrows. I'm going to be using the Anastasia Pomade in the color Ebony. And I, so I'm just going to comb my eyebrows out. And I'm going to apply the pomade. So 
sorry if you hear all this noise. I have the windows open. So now I'm just, I'm not doing much to my eyebrows. I'm just going back in. No, not back in. I'm going with the NYX tinted. I'm going in with the NYX brow mascara and I'm just going to go over my eyebrows. Alright, so I'm not going to be putting eyeshadow on today because I kind of just want to go for a wing and a bold lip. So I'm just going to be uh, doing a wing liner. Alright, so I did my eyeliner off camera because I couldn't do it. So now I'm going to go in with mascara. So for mascara, I'm going to using the L'Oreal Luminous Carbon Black Mascara. And I am going to be using um, false lashes. So I'm just going to put a light layer of this. Okay, so I just applied the lashes. Now I'm going to put a mascara on my lower lashes. And I'm going to use the NYC Smooth Skin Bronzing Face Powder and I'm just going to bronze up my face. <laughs> I'm going to put it on my neck and on my forehead. I'm going to use a chocolate soleil in medium deep and this is just the sample size and I'm going to contour with this alright so I don't know if I should use a blush since I am I'm not going to use a blush today. I'm just going to go for more of a bronze and highlighted look. So I'm going to be using the Mary Luminizer. It's one of my favorite highlighters ever. So I like an intense highlight. I like to pack on my highlight. Because I like to look very, very glowy. So I'm just going to put this on my cheeks, on the tip of my nose, and in my inner corners. So I don't know if I should go for more of a straight up orange look or if I should go for a reddish orange I think I'm gonna go with the orange since I didn't really use bright colors so I think I'm going to go with this one well, that's bright I'm not used to these types of colors so I want to try something different today so now I'm going to do my hair I don't know how I'm gonna do it I think I'm just gonna curl it cuz I can't really put it in a bun because my hair is too short and all of these hairs fall back so I think yeah I think I'm just gonna curl it okay so I decided to change the lipstick I was wearing the oh, I was wearing I was wearing a wet and wild one 
but I thought it was too much. And I am wearing Heat Wave by NARS, and I just think it looks a lot better and more put together. So yeah, I changed the lipstick. So now I'm going to go in with my hair. I'm going to be using Chi, Chi Smart Silk Voluminizing Iron Guard Mist. And I'm just going to spray that all over my hair. And I'm going to be using uh, coconut milk. Cook this coconut oil serum and I'm just going to apply that on my ends. I'm going to comb out my hair with this brush that I got from Forever 21. So I am going to be curling my hair and I'm going to be using the Numi 3-in-1 and I'm using the I don't know what size this is, but it's the middle one. This one came with three barrels, and this is the middle one. So I'm just going to put my hair in half. Alright guys, so this is the completed look. I wanted to go more for a bold lip since I rarely do. So I wanted to try the orange, but that didn't work. But I still love this look and the dramatic wing. So thank you for getting ready with me and I hope you enjoyed this video. Please thumbs up this video, share it, and yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.